Hello everyone! Welcome to a wedding update. We are about a week and a half away from the wedding. It is going by so fast. So let me just recap you. This originally started obviously when I got engaged back in May and we were planning our wedding for October but our venue was booked so basically we chose September which pushed our timeline. We also decided to move, buy a house, and remodel the house all before the wedding, as you can see by this mess of a room. So now we're a week and a half away and it is crunch time, but it's also like the only time I really had to plan. All the planning I did was in May and then I haven't even like really touched it until now. So it's a little stressful, but I'll update you on where I'm at in the process. I went and got my trial nails and I'll get them done for real, for real. Same thing, cause I really like this. The Wednesday before the wedding. Venue is booked, photographer is booked, food, bar, booked, playlist, we're DJing ourselves, done. And today we're gonna make all the signage, get a bunch of the decor together. So, something I'm really excited about. I've been seeing these all over like TikTok and stuff, and it is the best idea ever. So they're kind of like foam, so no one can get hurt since there's a bunch of kids gonna be at the wedding. But they're little glow sticks. Isn't that so cool? And there's like different modes. So I think this would be really fun at the dance party. And I have so much stuff in here for the wedding. So these are my bridal bags. Each bridesmaid has one and then I have one because I have some stuff I want to take. And I'll show you what I got everyone. We all have these like matching koozies. I just got a pack of them on Amazon. There's another one. And then since my colors are like fall colors, green is one of them. I got everyone green scrunchies and then mine came in a white scrunchie. If I had a tip for everyone, it would be to have five bridesmaids because everything comes in a pack of six and it's usually like five of one color and then white for the bride so perfect amount of bridesmaids and then these also came in a pack of six from amazon so this just worked out perfect they were pretty cheap for being high quality i don't remember exactly how much they were but it's better than just like a plastic bag but also everybody gets a pair of slippers let me try these out actually Oh my gosh, these are so soft and comfy. Um, the slippers are from Birdie Gray, so are the bridesmaid dresses and our getting ready outfits. Let me show you those. I haven't even tried mine on yet, but these are the bride ones and they're just like um, pajamas. Here we go. I should probably try mine on, but I got little shorts the top and then everybody's top has their name on the back and then mine says bride on the back. So here's an example of one of the bridesmaids, Lily. And it's like a really cute green color. First I'm just doing a haul, I guess. Oh my gosh, I have to show you all my shoes. A little bit of a giveaway on my outfit. <laughs> Actually, who knows when this video is gonna be posted. Okay, these are my wedding day shoes. I got them from Lulu's. Oh, okay. This is my flower girl basket. And then I got her a little gift. This is the box. We're not having a ring bearer, but this is our rings box. Oh, also literal life hack. So on Amazon, I went and bought this wedding band. I'm wearing it because I'm testing it out to see what style I like before I spend a bunch of money on an actual wedding band. It was like eight bucks. Obviously it's gonna like turn my finger green soon, but it'll work for now for the wedding. And then I can like take my time deciding on what kind of band I want. Cause I just didn't know. And I love the shape and style of this one. So I'm gonna look for a real one that's similar. So I'm about to make all the signs for the table I'm not doing like tables with table numbers. So on one side, I'm gonna have this like disposable camera scan thing. It's like an app to take pictures on. And then the other side is gonna be the timeline. And then I'm gonna print out little menus. I got these cute like green napkins. I think I might need to order more napkins. That is not very many, I feel like. And then this is what all of my like silverware, whatever you call it, is called. No, sorry. What am I saying? Oh my gosh. The plates and the forks and everything is like, they're all disposable, but like nice disposable. Gold and white. Some stuff to decorate the arbor. These are for my tables. Oh my gosh, yes. I custom made these Converse for my reception. And then I know I'm gonna wear them because I love these. I put vines on them, which, you know, kind of my thing. And then that is my last name. I was gonna do our wedding day, but it kind of looked weird on the back. I like the last name better, so. And then I have like, this is brown, brown, green. So, really cute, I like them a lot. I literally can't wait to wear them because I tried them on and they're like memory foam on the inside. They're really comfortable. There's like a bunch of other stuff, but that's like the main stuff I was excited to show y'all. So, now I need to do all the annoying stuff. I think I'm just gonna chill in these slippers, honestly. Should I try on all my little outfits for you guys? I don't know if I feel like doing that. We'll do that later. I also just got some more packages, so let's open these. I have so many boxes, it's unreal because remodeling my house and getting married, just, yeah, it's crazy. Oh, that's what these are. Oh, these are cute. 
I got these like candle votives. Is that what they're called? Votives? And I'm gonna put real candles in them and just put them on the table. It's gonna be so cute. So cute. And then I think the other box should be the actual candle. Perfect. Okay, let's get a sample going. Votive candle. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. It's perfect. And then once it's lit, just like a little flame. They're not scented. I didn't think they were, but that is adorable. I cannot wait for that, actually. As I was filming, I literally just got another package. So let's open this. Oh, this is not wedding related. Well, I'll show it anyway. So what I, this is actually the first thing I've ever bought at a TikTok shop. I just thought it was too cute not to buy. Okay, anyway, moving on. I just thought of this. I think setting up a table in here, which is all the wedding stuff, see it all together, is a pretty good idea. So... Let's do that. Hello, it is the next day. And I've got my Erin running outfit on. I'm gonna go run some errands for a little bit of wedding stuff shopping, some house stuff shopping. We are so close to the wedding, I'm kind of falling apart. But here's kind of what I have so far. I think this is absolutely adorable. I made a dinner menu. I need to buy more of these cardstock things. Um, and then we have the centerpiece kind of stuff. Got these, obviously, as you saw. So that's kind of what the tables will look like. And then on the back of this is this like QR code that people can scan. And it's like a disposable camera app thing. I also just placed another huge Amazon order and y'all. No one talks about the last like month leading up to the wedding, you just go broke. But it's just like, oh, I need this, oh, I need this, oh, I need this. Budget? Don't know her. It literally sucks. I'm crying. But anyway, I also just placed my order for my cake. Do not follow in my direction. Place the order for your cake months ahead. I was like, oh yeah, I'll get to it. Yep, I'll get to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like next weekend, we'll do it. Now we're a week away from the wedding. There is no time to make a cake. Luckily, on Facebook, I found like a local bakery and they do gluten-free options, which is another thing. If you need specialty cakes, like gluten-free or something, that should be well in advance. Not me. No, I did not do that. So, uh, talk to someone. They have an opening. They're gonna make my cake and my cupcakes and it's gonna be so good. One of the flavors for the cupcakes is pumpkin spice with espresso frosting. Are you kidding me? that's gonna hit i got that triple chocolate vanilla and red velvet all within like you know the cake the cupcakes amongst all of that so that's gonna hit the fit is actually why did i say it like that the fit is actually all from amazon literally fanny pack romper tank top all from amazon my shoes are from amazon but everything else also another somewhat wedding related thing is my house since i'm having abram's family stay with us saturday night and i'm having my bachelorette party here wednesday night and then I'm having my bridesmaids stay the night, Thursday night. This house needs to be clean and put together. And our carpet downstairs doesn't go in until the end of this week. And the wedding's next week. So, wish me luck. I'm gonna bring my headphones so I can jam out. I forgot it's literally Labor Day, so everything's popping. So, I'm not gonna bring my camera. Hopefully, I can get some footage on my phone. Not the random literal storm. Well, this is the perfect time to go over some of my thoughts. Y'all, I'm so excited for my wedding. Like, could not be more excited. I've had like no anxiety, none of that. Even if everything goes wrong, even if, you know, cause everything's been, I feel like last minute since I was working on the house and not as much the wedding. Even if it all goes wrong, I'm still so excited. I can't wait, it's gonna be such a great day. And I can't wait to see all my old friends from Texas, my family everything it's just gonna be so good so originally i was like oh my wedding you know it's five six months away whatever from when i got engaged i'm gonna be on a diet i'm gonna work out all the time i'm gonna lose some weight no none of that happened i didn't lose any weight um i didn't gain any weight though i've been like fluctuating but honestly guys it doesn't matter like don't feel pressured to like look a certain way or lose weight on your wedding day if you want if you want to go for it that's awesome i totally get wanting to look your best on your wedding day but my life has just been too hectic like i couldn't even use my kitchen for pretty much a month all of august i had no kitchen i had to eat out like every day i'm not even kidding it was awful and then like we wouldn't get done with house projects till like 1am the only thing open is fast food 
So it was a little rough. Oh, I was gonna go to Walmart. Do I really want to? I'll do that another day. I don't have more days. Whatever. Wedding is T minus six days away. <laughs> Ooh. So I'm packing up all the boxes for, well, everything. This is box one and it's just all of the table stuff basically, table decor and whatnot. And I'm gonna label it. I also just made this. That was the last clip I had of the wedding prep. I thought I had more, but it became so hectic that I had to stop recording because there was so much to do. The Saturday before the wedding, I spent nine hours that day prepping for the wedding because I hadn't done anything. I made binders, I made all the centerpieces, everything was done that day and it was hectic. But that is it for this video. I hope you still enjoyed just seeing a lot of the sneak peeks of what the wedding would look like and me just like frantically getting everything together. And I also just wanna say, I'm sorry that all these videos are coming out so late. My wedding was September 15th and we're in November now, but I hope you guys are happy that the next video that comes out is a wedding week video, which includes bachelorette party, rehearsal dinner, all of the really fun, exciting stuff, my best friend coming into town. And then the video after that will be the actual wedding vlog. I already have the next video almost ready to go so hopefully it'll come out soon and you won't have to wait forever and then the wedding video shortly after so if you guys are excited to see the last two videos of my wedding content then make sure to hit subscribe see you there Bye -bye.